Hello and welcome PFO teens, buddies, families, advisors, special guests, everybody. My name is James and I am over the moon with excitement to welcome you to a very, very, very special, never done before playing for others event, our buddy show special preview concert. We are gonna get started with the music in just a moment, but first I wanna give you a little bit of background information about what the heck this event is. So as you know, every year in the Playing for Others Spring Arts Festival, we do a buddy show with our buddies, we have a red carpet event, we do an original musical that the teens perform in, and unfortunately during our pandemic year we aren't able to do a live and in-person performance like that. So when we realized that this was going to be a mostly virtual season, we said let's figure out if there's something unique that we can do this year that would still be really really special and really really awesome that we haven't ever been able to do before. And what we we came up with was let's have our teens, our PFO teens, actually write a brand new original musical that can be our buddy show as soon as it is safe for all of us to gather again in person. And that is just what we did. So this past fall, myself alongside advisors Rose and Khalif facilitated a special musical theater writing arts experience where all the PFO teens worked on songs and stories and scenes for a brand new musical about animals called Animal Madness that is going to be a new buddy show for playing for others. And tonight, we are going to share a sneak preview of five of those songs from the new show. I want to be very clear that even though we are sharing five songs and highlighting the work of five teens in particular, every single teen was involved in this project and has been involved in the writing process from the beginning. So though we're celebrating these five songs because that's what the special preview is going to be, I want to congratulate all the teens and I hope you will join me in celebrating all of the teens who worked so hard, were so creative, had so much fun as we figure out how we can make a show for when we are able to perform in front of a live audience again. So in a few moments, we're going to start sharing some of these songs. And one of the cool things is all of the performers tonight are friends of mine from my musical theater community here in New York City. We thought it would be an awesome, unique opportunity this year to bring the Playing for Others community and the musical theater community here in New York together for this special event. These performers are so incredibly talented. They have appeared in the Broadway and national touring productions of so many of your favorite musicals, both on stage and in the orchestra pit. This list is crazy. I have to read it to you because I'm so excited. They are so incredibly talented. They have been in Hamilton, Aladdin, Anastasia, The Book of Mormon, Once on this Island, Spring Awakening, Fun Home, Buyer and Seller, Motown, Porgy and Beth, Hades Town, How the Grinch Stole Christmas, and The Lion King. But that's not all. We have a lot of incredible comedy performers in the ensemble tonight who perform with the New York Neo Futurists and perform at Upright Citizens Brigade. Some of these musicians that you're about to hear from have performed with Lizzo and Frank Ocean. And they are all advocates of all different kinds. They're educators, they work with the disability community, they have talent through the roof. But the thing that makes this so special is these are all performers who I believe in their core embody and practice the values of playing for others. So it's been so special to introduce PFO to these performers, to introduce these performers to playing for others. Now, a couple of quick housekeeping things before we get the show started. First of all, uh, everything tonight is completely closed captioned, so if you would like your captions on, all you have to do is hit that CC button and it will be captioned for you. And also, please do hang out in the chat. Uh, let us know what you love. Congratulate our teens. Congratulate our performers. Uh, let's be engaged. We're all going to have a really, really special time tonight. And now, I think without further ado, let's get this show started. So this first song tonight uh, is of the story of an elephant named Ellie. And Ellie is very self-conscious because she is the smallest of the elephants. And she knows that the new 
new trumpeting competition that's happening where all the elephants use their trunks is her shot to prove everyone wrong and show them that even though she's the littlest elephant doesn't mean that she can't make really big amazing music. So this story and the words for this song were written by McRae and the performers in this piece are Allie B. Gory as Ellie the Elephant, Remy Germanario as her brother Eli the Elephant, and Kyra Sims as Eli's friend. Without further ado, please enjoy the song, My Trunket. Hi McCray, it's Remy Germanario. I just wanted to say a fantastic job with My Trunket, My Trunket. I have had it in my head all week, no joke. Fantastic writing. I had a fabulous time performing it. It has such a wonderful message. I think the young people who will watch it will really get something out of it and be moved by it and inspired by it. So I encourage you to keep on writing and spreading positivity through your work. You rock. My trunket, my trunket, the trumpet sound my trunk makes my trunket, oh my trunket, the trumpet sound my trunk makes. Come on, Ellie, show them what you got. Show them you aren't the loser of the lot. Oh, Ellie, it's impossible for you to win. We all know you belong in the failure. With a toot toot here and a toot toot there and a toot toot everywhere. Ready? Begin. Do 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 another round. I'm sure I'll win this time. <laughs> sure, but be prepared to lose. <laughs> With a toot toot here and a toot toot there and a toot toot everywhere my trunket, my trunket, the trumpet sound my trunk makes my trunket, my trunket, the trumpet sound my trunk makes. This next song comes to us from Nora, who wrote the story, the lyrics, and the music for this song. It's all about a giraffe who, similar to Ellie, is also self-conscious because they are not as tall as the other giraffes. So this song is called Up There, and it features performances by Adam Hindman and Jasmine Malave. Hi, Nora. This is Adam Hindman from the cast of Hades Town on Broadway, and I'm so happy that I got a chance to sing your song. Keep writing, keep sharing your art, and congratulations. Oh, how was your day at school today, sweetheart? Same as always. I still haven't made any friends, and all the teachers overlook me. Maybe you just need to try a little harder. You'll get there. No. You, you... You just don't understand. They say stand up tall. I stand my tallest, but my tallest isn't tall enough. I try and go 
hang out and play with the other kids But I get overlooked by everyone I can't reach the leaves on top of the trees I'm always left asking, can I have some please? Always asking for help, cause I can't do it myself Cause no one looks out for the poor little elf I just wanna see the world from way up above Maybe then I would be enough I would be tall as the sky And make friends with the stars Maybe then I'd be on their radar Oh, how lovely life would be From way up there The giraffe's way of life is just not for me You gotta be tall as the mountains to succeed I'm as tall as a stump, I see life from below Every day it feels like I'm living in a shadow Cause I'm monkey in the middle Kids just laugh and giggle Can make a name for myself when I'm not seen I've got to get used to living life in the in-between I just want to see the world from way up above Maybe then I would be enough I want to be tall as the sky And make friends with the stars Maybe then I'd be on their radar Oh, how lovely life would be From way up there If I were as tall as Mount Everest They might actually care But as far as I can see, I'm stuck down here. Our next song comes to us from Phoebe. This is the story of an owl named Ollie who has a little bit of a problem. Ollie, because he's an owl, is nocturnal, so he's awake all night. But all of his friends who aren't nocturnal are only awake during the day, so they never get to see each other. So let's watch Ollie's song and see how Ollie and his friends decide to solve this problem. This song features performances from Stephen Cuevas as Ollie and Jordan Matthew Brown as Danny. Hey Phoebe, this is Stephen. I just wanted to let you know I had so much fun performing Ollie's song. I thought it was such a fun number. I can't wait to see how it turned out, and I can't wait to see what else you do. I hope you keep writing and creating, and who knows, maybe one day in the near future we'll collaborate again. That would be fun. All right, take care. Bye. My name is Ollie. I'm nocturnal, but my friends are not when I'm awake. With my family They are fast asleep This makes me so very sad I feel left out Because when I'm fast asleep They are hanging out So I decided I'll stay up During the day but since I love my family I'll still stay up at night Now I'm very tired And my parents noticed They told me I have to sleep during the day again I'm just so sad again And my friends are too Cause we love hanging out so much Without it, we're so blue, oh, so, so blue. blue, sad I'm not hanging out with you, oh, oh so, so blue. blue, I miss you, oh no, the sun is coming up, that's my bedtime. Hi, my name is Danny the Deer. I'm one of Ollie's friends. 
We miss him oh so much. So one afternoon when we all met up, we came up with a plan, a plan to let us all hang out. So no one is sad. We'll wake up early in the morning before Ollie goes to bed. Eat breakfast together and catch up with our friend. Danny? Ollie! Look, look what you friend. did! Oh, you guys. Let's sing! Now no one's blue Cause we get to hang out with you Together again Happy to be the best of friends Yeah, no one's blue Cause we get to hang out with you Together again Happy to be the best, the, the best, best of friends. This next song tells the story of Ralph the Robin, who has a little bit of trouble connecting with the other birds at the bird bath because they're all songbirds. They like to sing songs all day. But Ralph has a bit of a different, more unique talent. This story and lyrics come to us from Peyton. The song is performed by Julius Thomas III. Please enjoy Rappin' Robin. What's up, Peyton? It's Julius Thomas III, star of Hamilton the Musical. Listen, I got your rap. I think it's really awesome. And I just want to encourage you to keep doing what you're doing because you very obviously have a talent for it. All right? Congratulations. Yo, I'm Ralph the Robin and I really think I'm bopping. I spread my wings and then rap without stopping. But honestly, I have a problem, you see. All these other songbirds really don't like me. I know that I'm the smoothest rapping, robbing around. But if you let them tell it, it's not a great sound. They like the high note, the opera. You know Broadway, I like fast lyrics like they're speeding on the highway. All the other birds have their friends and their fun. But me, on the other hand, I really Really have none. I act all tough and say I wanna be a star, but having a few buddies is the best by far. If they could take a moment to see me for me, then we can all make music from tree to tree. Cause I'm a rapping robin. What did you say? I'm the bird that raps all night and day. Yo, I'm a rapping robin. Yeah, that's what you heard. Every rap makes me fly like these other birds. I'm a rapping robin. What did you say? I'm the bird that raps all night and day cause I'm a rapping robin yeah that's what you heard every rap makes me fly like these other birds yeah uh oh hey 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 My friends, we have arrived at our final song tonight in this special preview event, so let's get right to it. This song is called Feisty's Big Adventure. The story and lyrics were written by Storm, and it tells the story of a goldfish named Feisty who is excited to see the world beyond just their fishbowl, but in the process, gets themselves stuck in some pretty wacky situations. This song will feature performances by Samantha Williams and a very special friend to playing for others, the sibling of one of our buddies, Abby Corrigan. Enjoy Feisty's Big Adventure. Hey Storm, Sammy here. I just wanted to send you a quick video thanking you for letting me sing your song. I had a blast. It was so incredible, so fun to learn and record. I hope you enjoyed my watery backdrop here. <laughs> but really, I had so much fun and you're an incredible writer. You're so talented and I really want you to promise that you'll keep going. In whatever you do, just put 100% in because you really are so special. Um, I hope we get to work together soon. Bye! Thank you for letting me sing your song! <laughs> Pretty neat, though there's not a lot to do. 
I swim around the tank for hours. My heart is craving something new. My eyes are always searching for a way to breathe free. Just beyond the glass I can see. A picture of something bright yellow with, with fruit and sugar. It smells so sweet and it looks so beautiful in the sunlight. Oh, I want to swim in it. No one is around. My mission is quite clear. Just one big jump and I'm out of here. Here I go! <gasps> Made it! Now I'm free at last. Oh, I'm free at last. I'm in a foreign substance, but I'm free. Lemonade. Freedom tastes like lemonade on a hot summer's day. Feisty! Mom, come back to the fishbowl. Feisty, listen to your mother. This is your final warning. I'm not giving you another. Okay, okay. <sighs> back, Feisty. I love sense of adventure. I love that you have no fear, but a fish belongs in water. Promise me you'll stay right here. Fine. Promise, okay. That's a good little fish. Now, I'm gonna go clean some of the fake seaweed. I'll see you later. <laughs> Mother only wants what's best, but my heart wants to roam. I'm made for something greater than this tiny goldfish home. I simply can't stop searching for a way to break free. Just beyond the glass, I can't see. Something rich and savory most delicious thing I've ever smelled. Chocolate? I want to swim in it. No one is around. My mission is quite clear. Just one big jump and I'm out of here. Here I go! Made it! Now I'm free at last. Oh, I'm free at last. My fingers are cold and sticky, but I'm free at last. Yes, I'm free at last. Oh, I'm free at last. Oh, it's hard to breathe. I'm free at last. Freedom tastes like chocolate milk. Sweet and gooey chocolate milk. Freedom tastes like chocolate milk at a party with my friends. I'm loving it. Free. And that's our show, everyone. Thank you so much for being a part of this special event tonight. Big shout out to McCray and Nora and Phoebe and Peyton and Storm and all of the teens who worked so hard on making new stories for us to make an original musical. Big PFO gratitude to all of our performers and to everyone who was here tonight to make it extra, extra special. It truly makes my heart sing that we were all able to make this happen.
happen. So if you would like to join us in the Zoom room, meet some of the awesome performers from tonight, we're gonna have a Q&A about what it is like to be a professional artist, what it is like to perform for a living, and go a, a little bit into how we made these songs happen. So if you would like to do that, the link to the Zoom was in the confirmation email. Otherwise, we hope that you are having a wonderful spring, and I cannot wait to be in person with all of you at a big special PFO event whenever we are able to. I am counting down the days, my friends. I truly cannot wait. Thank you for being here tonight. Take care and be well, and I am sending all my wiggly fingers from New York City. Bye, bye, bye.